<clears throat> so next travel tip while you're in Japan, there's two things you should know. The JR Pass, which is your Japanese rail pass, you can only buy it in the States and they'll deliver it to wherever you're staying. It looks like this. It's about 240 bucks, and what you do is you order it online and you have it sent to the hotel or the hostel where you're staying at and it gives you access to all the bullet trains uh, for the eastern part of Japan, Kyoto, uh, Osaka, a lot of the major cities and all you do is present it. It also gives you access to the, uh, to the rails, to the, uh, to the subway, so you don't need to buy a separate metric card. Secondly, and I think which is the most important, I said it earlier, this Sukia card. I call it the Susia card. Now, with this thing, when you fill it up, it's like a Metro Pass, but unlike the Metro Pass, you can pretty much go to, I don't know, I'm gonna move for some green tea right now. Hit the green tea, hit the Susia Pass, and out comes the green tea. Honestly, the Japanese, like, pff, they have it down pat. All you ever need is a Susia Pass and a Rail Pass. Either way, it's your boy Jerry gone. Go to the supermarket right now. I'm gonna buy some eggs. I'm gonna make my dorm a typical American breakfast. I'm gonna get everybody chubby. You guys check in. Next stop today, Cherry Blossom Festival, and then Kyoto tomorrow. Boy Jay Aragon signing off. Holla at your cuz. Hmm.